Hey everybody, welcome back to Bolt Gun. So we're moving right along with map 3, or level 3, or whatever 3, whatever you want to call it. So, uh, this is still part of the, uh, part of the part of the game bleh, that I've played, so... This is not going to be too much of a surprise for me. Of course, then again, it was kind of like late in the evening, so, um... Is a distinct possibility that I might forget a few things here and there, but... Yep. Oh, not locking on, I see. Little bastard. Yeah, there is a little bit of a highlight effect when you lock on. Oh yeah, pink horrors. They're like pinkies, except worse. And they spawn blue horrors, but you can see kind of like an outline if... Yeah, that red outline when they're meleeable, if you will. So the uh, pink horrors fire homing projectiles, which is great. And then when you kill them, they spawn into two blue horrors. Yeah, they're uh, they're great. Yep, see, blue horror, blue horror, awesome. Not gonna come to me. Okay, enjoy that. Stupid heretic! Yeah, see, it's funny, because, like, I play- I also play heretic, which means that I am both the heretic and the hunter of heretics. Slayer of heretics? The heretic slayer? I don't know. Give me that. Ooh, this might hurt a little bit. Let's get back this way. My health is not looking super hot right now. Super hot. Super hot. Ooh, that was a... Bit of a... Bit of an overshoot, but I think it actually killed him. Fascinating. Well, I think even like with the normal like time grenades, I think if it hits someone, they will get wrecked pretty hard by it. Another thing I need to get used to with this game, I still haven't gotten used to, is when you, um, with the way that the weapons work, they don't have, like, a dedicated melee key like Doom. It's actually more like Doom Eternal, where melee is just kind of a secondary. But that also means that your standard bolt gun is slot number one, and shotgun is number th number two instead of number three. So, um, yeah, I'm sure that's not going to mess me up in any sort of critical way at all. Actually, weirdly enough, the uh, weapons seem to be... Very much akin, like, slot-wise, at least the ones that I've seen so far, to, uh, Doom Eternal. Because, like, slot 3 is the plasma rifle. Well, plasma gun. It's, um, it's actually, like, a heavy plasma. Complete with splash damage. So, um... So it's pretty fun. Alright, another one of these bastards. Yay, secret! Oh, munition spoon. Basically like a temporary backpack. Yeah. Fun times. Oh, that took a while to dissipate. Holy moly. Alright, onward. Did I go behind this building yet? Was there a way behind this build? No, there's not. Okay. I got my buildings confused. Can I just... Oh, oh well. <laughs> There might be a way to do that. I just really, you know. Alright, so. Onward to this place, then over to this place. Is there something connected to this? Uh, yeah, there is. There's this key thing, and then there's that super duper health power up, or, sorry, contempt power up. Awesome. So now we have one of the keys. The, um, the. Sigma? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Sigma. Grab that. Okay, I'm full on bolt gun ammo. That's good. I think was it at the beginning here? I probably just passed it. In fact, I'm almost certain I did. Yeah, this is this is where I started. Okay. Let's try that again with less embarrassment. Yeah, there's a uh, sigma. <laughs> Fun. 
Follow the path. Follow the path. Now. Ooh, nice. Machine Spirit Prison. Omnisaya? Look, I don't know any of these terms. I'm probably speaking just as much heresy as these guys are. Who knows? It's one of the things I kind of like about 40k is there's no real good guys from what I've seen. There's just like... There's eh people and then worse people. I don't know. Oh. Got more stuff from my bolt gun. And... Oh, hello there. I'm wondering if I should go to the other side. Or if this all just wraps around. I cannot remember. I think... I, I'm not sure. Let's just... Let's just do it. I do have a little bit of air control from... Yeah. A little bit of air control. It's not as ridiculous as, like, Marathon. But it's not as, uh... Static as, like, Doom. Ah, oh, balls. Whoa. Uh, frame rate tankage? <laughs> Ow. It's nothing worse, especially with everything being hit scanned and just kind of walking right into something. Oh. Turns out I used all my grenades on uh, standard mooks. Oh well. It's a Chaos Space Marine. It's not that bad. Jeez. Alright, which side do I want to go into first? That one had the more obvious, like, uh, grapple here markers, so. I'm going to try the other side. I don't remember if I actually did this last time I went through here. Alright, there we go. And jump. Oh no, the stone does have the head of the, the, the thunker. I don't know how I managed to miss the barrel that many times, but you know what? I hit it eventually. That's all that matters. Yep. Hit three for the shotgun again. Uh Sure. Flamer. Has a potential to do high damage at close range. I mean, as the name kind of implies. I mean, look at that. One of the things to uh, note with this game, fire bad. I mean, it's kind of like in Heretic, strangely enough, where, um, like, the fire attacks just seem to do the, like, an absolutely absurd amount of damage. Where's your friend? Oh, well. I was hoping to try to get both of you in one shot, but, uh... Did I already get him? Oh. Apparently, if you jib them hard enough, they can't split. I don't know. Alright, let's, uh... Let's switch back to this. Awesome. Oh, hello. All right, y'all good? So I'm good, <laughs> dude. Stop. Okay, sure. That worked. Yeah, put one round in there. I should have just blew up the barrel. I don't know why I wasted a grenade on that. Oh well, you know, everything blew up nice, so, um, I will take it. Oh my god, I love it! <laughs> well, take care of you. Yeah, I don't want to stay too close to them, because I'm not entirely sure how their stuns work. It could be one of those things where as long as you, uh, you know, maybe I'll experiment with the other one. Oh, my bad. I mixed up the flamers. Ha <laughs> ha. Excellent. Can you hit me right now? It doesn't look like it. It actually kind of looks like the, uh... I don't know what it's called. The, the chainsaw analog in this game 
seems to kind of work the way that I think Doom's Chainsaw should have worked, where it just basically will just stun lock an enemy. A single enemy. Like, you could still get wrecked from the sides and behind, but you don't have to worry about, uh... About just an enemy attacking through it. Which is the thing that I always thought was such a pain in the ass about Doom. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Oh yeah, this is the other side. Cool. So the whole objective was to... Oh, excuse me. Was to get that one key. I don't remember what that symbol is. <laughs> the thing that kind of looks like an hourglass. Marika. Alright, here's the door for it. Oh, hello there. How did you... Oh, I guess I did go through here every other time. That's funny. That's funny. So, let's go ahead and just unlock this and move in. Oh, hello. Yeah, you see the grenade point blank. Did not really do all that much to him. Shotgun handled him pretty nicely, though. Okay. Yeah, sure, I'll take that. Probably wasted it, but, uh, you know. Y'all should be used to that. Splat! Oh, man, it feels good. <laughs> oh, that's epic. Alright. <laughs> Here we go again! I guess another benefit to playing somewhat aggressively. Yeah, Contempt full. I am full of Contempt. But anyone who's seen my day as Volt playthrough knows that, so, um... Gotta watch out for the guy behind. Ow. Oh, haha. <laughs> that was one of those things with the, uh, the right-click... Uh... Lunge attack? I don't know what that's called. Charge attack? Charge attack, there we go. But the right click lunge, uh, charge. I keep calling it lunge attack. Why? Um, it's a little weird because sometimes, like, if you um, screw up the distance, which I do all the time, you just wind up stopping right in front of the enemy, which is um, not the most effective way of handling it. We'll put it that way. Oh. I underestimated his health pool, apparently. Awesome. Oh, wait. Ooh, he parried. Nice. Well, hey, at least I know that's a thing. It's one of those things you definitely don't want to uh, discover on the fly, if you will. Okay, yeah, so I do have mouse wheel bound up to that. I want to make sure. Man, I love the movement in this. Like, I can't possibly express that enough. Oh, here's an arena. I think this one actually killed me the first time I played this. Let's see if I can do it this time. We've got a pretty good idea. Oh, yeah, this one definitely did kill me. Yeah, when the screen takes on that red red tint, you can see in that enable purge protocols on the side there. That's how you know you're in for a treat. Or death. It depends on the arena. There were a couple in level 4 that were, uh, well, the next level, that were pretty gnarly. Oh, baby. I mean, that's only 20 health, but still 20 health I'd rather not lose. Interesting how they infight with the pink horrors. Probably just the horrors in general, really. Oh, yeah, that's one of those cases where it does an unnecessary ledge grab. And that can really screw you over if you're uh, kind of critical on health, which um, you start getting. All oh, right, I, sc I screwed that up. Oh boy, yeah, that's that's one of the the game's issues. That and the lack of auto run, or always run. Whoa. Um. Well, that wasn't exactly where I wanted to go, but uh, I guess that's one way of getting out of dodge. 
Even though I didn't really want to get out of dodge at the time, that's that's fine. That's fine. So anyway, one of the little tricks here, if you lunge and then jump, which I screwed up, you do keep some forward momentum. Ooh. I caught up on that ledge. That was a little nasty. Let's see if I can... Wait, what? I couldn't get the lunge to... Not the lunge. Maybe it's not working out of just sheer contempt because I keep calling it lunge when it's called charge. Ooh, flamer. Get the hell out of my way. So yeah, if you do that and then jump, you will carry over some of that forward momentum. There we go. Ouch. Wasn't exactly the power-up I was hoping for, I guess. Do I have something back here? Not what I really want, but whatever. I'll take this health anyway. Also, that little red thing, that's what the um, arena's exit door looks like. Ooh, you might actually get to see what happens when you die. 37 health to Contempt. Looking great. Looking absolutely great, and I just jumped over Contempt. Health. Alright. That's the Terminator! <laughs> Go ahead and switch to uh, this thing. Hey! Purge resolved. Nice. Also, I find it really funny that they, uh, like, the literal monsters that you see are not part of the purge protocol. It's literally just, like, the uh, the Chaos Space Marines. Yeah, good stuff. Alright, let's, uh, let's go ahead and loot the arena real fast, and then uh, we're gonna go ahead to the exit. So I did manage to do this first try. It helped that I knew where the items were. That's one thing I do remember. Even if I actually lost more health than I probably should have by getting that, like, Berserk power-up, Oh well, what's gonna do? Hmm. Very quake like water animation. I like it. Alright, so you know, I'm not actually sure if ammo carries over, so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab all that stuff. Alright, I think I'm full up. I know the health doesn't, so there's no point in doing that. Oh, hi there. What's up, little guy? I think he got a little stuck there. That's okay. All right, over here and out the door. Level complete. 99% Oh man. <laughs> Come on, where's where's DSDA bolt gun? I need my extended HUD. All right. Well, that was level 3. Still fun. Level 4 does kind of introduce an enemy that's a bit annoying. Just annoying ankle biters. I think they're called Meyer Lurks. I don't know. Again, my 40k knowledge is a bit uh, spotty, but uh, they're they're annoying. But we'll we'll figure out a way to get through them. That that's actually where the charge attack kind of comes uh, comes into its own is with smaller stuff like that. A little bit less with things that can actively kill you and well not not actively kill you. Everything can kill you, but things that can actively shoot you. Yeah. So. Yeah, that was Bolt Gun Level 3. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.